Hey guys, Jimmy here. Um, continuing week three, we got three NFL guys to write to. Um, all three are pretty exciting. Um, so let's take a look at them. So first up, we got Pete Banizek. I got duplicate cards of him. Um, he was a longtime Raider, was in Super Bowl two, and actually won a Super Bowl with them as well. Um, he was also part of the Holy Roller play, which is a very uh, famous play. I had to look up some history and some background on it. Um, and that play actually prompted a rule change, and the rule has been in effect since. So um, the Raiders were playing the Chargers, <clears throat> and uh, there was a fumble in, towards the last seconds of the game. And Pete and a fellow teammate kind of batted the, batted the football towards the end zone and then recovered it in the end zone for a touchdown. And it was the game-winning touchdown. So uh, let me read you guys this little paragraph from Wikipedia explaining the new rule that came from that. Um, and I actually didn't know about this rule. So kind of neat there. Uh, the new rule is if a player fumbles after the two minute warning in a half or overtime or on fourth down at any time during the game, only the fumbling player can recover and advance the ball. If that player's teammate recovers the ball during those situations, it is placed back at the spot of the fumble, unless it was a recovery for a loss, in which case the ball is dead and placed at the point of the recovery. So kind of neat there. He, he was part of history and part of a, a rule change. So kind of cool. Um, so pretty excited to write to him. Next up, we got Al Baker. Um, he's part of the 100 Sack Club and uh, went to three Pro Bowls. So pretty cool there. I think some of his sacks might have been unofficial. But um, according to Pro Football Reference, um, they, have, uh, they started trying to backtrack and keep sacks and have unofficial sacks since 1961. So um, part of the 100 sack club, um, pretty cool there. Excited to write to him. And then last but not least, we got Steve Bartkowski. Um, <clears throat> he was in two Pro Bowls and he's actually one of 10 quarterbacks to have consecutive 30 touchdown seasons. Um, so pretty cool. Um, so yeah, those are the three guys I'm writing to this week. They'll go out tomorrow. Um, Pretty good week so far. Um, looking forward to getting some MLB guys tomorrow. So thanks.